As content is imported into a specific range in Myriad 6 Media Wall, it is normalized to the target level that is set for that range. So here you can see between 10,000 and 80,000 is designated as songs and currently we're using RMS normalization and it's set to a target of minus 8.6 dB. In previous versions of Myriad, the audio was altered as it was imported to hit this target level. But in Myriad 6, the default method is actually to apply that normalization scale factor at playtime so the original audio is not actually affected by the normalization process. Under normal circumstances, there's no need to change the normalization scale factor. After all, the point of normalization is to have the loudest point in each media item in a range to be the same level. But if you do need to do it, you can actually apply that change very easily using the edit window. And you can also mass apply changes if needed. Let's take a look at how to change the scale factor for normalization. Select the media item you want to change the normalization scale factor on. Click on edit and then switch to the other tab. And you can see the volume playback gain setting at the top here. And you can also set the level. So you can manually set the level here. Or you can click on auto detect, which will scan the media file and set the scale factor based on the set the target setting for this media range. When you're happy, click on save. Let's say you wanted to change the normalization target for a range of media. You can do that by going to the database settings in settings and go to media ranges and then change the target for that particular range within here. Once you've reset the target, anything that is imported into that range will use the new target level for normalization. However, the existing items in that range will retain their, their previous scale factor for normalization. But you can change them en masse as well. If you go to reports and then go to media reports, select the items you wish to change. Click on the media processing button, choose normalize. And here you can see the selected media items. And if we clicked on start processing media, it would go through and rescan these and reapply the new scale factor to hit the new target we just set for that range.